Oh, Brian, Edie, you're going to want to hold on to your face mask because based on what these local business owners we spoke with tell me, you can expect to see more people wearing your, their face masks indoors when they shop. Staff at Sacramento Boba Shop T4 shake and serve drinks for thirsty customers. Some patrons wearing face masks, others opting out. Very stressful. A sight that concerns food service workers like Christian Tomoloso, exposed to dozens of new faces every day. For the last 18 months, staff here have masked up, though most of them are vaccinated. We still got to make sure the safety is there because we don't want anyone to catch it. The store owner welcoming Sacramento County's new public health guidance, which strongly recommends face masks for everyone indoors. If one of my staff catches it, then basically all my staff can catch it. I think we should do everything we can to be as safe as possible. This customer says he's happy to follow the new guidelines to keep his daughter and those around her safe. At nine years old, Natalie Chapman still doesn't qualify to be vaccinated. She may not have symptoms, but she could come into contact with somebody as an elderly person who would develop a, a more serious condition. And despite the new recommendation, the fact remains that not everyone who enters a local business like this one is vaccinated. In fact, the Sacramento County reports only 47% of the local population here are vaccinated for COVID-19. With the Delta variant coming around, I feel it's very important that we just keep the masks on until it's all blown over. In Elk Grove, masked customers wait to be seated at Taiwanese restaurant Tasty Pot. While restaurants no longer face capacity limits, the manager here is still socially distancing diners by table. About having masks indoor, I do agree. But uh, having a dine-in situation, the customers always have to take their mask off to eat. We asked the manager if he worried that his business could be asked to shut down again. I have to, you know, leave that question to the experts. All too familiar with adapting to ever-changing public health guidelines, with no clear end to the pandemic in sight. And we also heard from the Sacramento Metro Chamber of Commerce. They showed their support for today's strong recommendation that everyone wear face masks indoors, regardless of vaccination status, sharing with us in a statement that we must continue to do everything that we can to uh, keep people safe, healthy, and avoid any further potential shutdown scenarios. Reporting live from Sacramento, Stephanie Lynn, KCRA 3 News. Okay, thanks for that perspective, Stephanie.